I finally made my own deodorant. And it's actually working for me. The consistency is perfect. <laughs> and it's completely all natural. So that's a plus. What did she do? How did I do it? What did I do? What did I use? I will tell you. So this jar is like um, an, the second of the first one. The first one I had was completely full and it's just like cocoa butter that I had um, for a couple of like years actually. And it's really special because it was a blend, like a really special blend of cocoa butter from like um, another like product maker who was like super into their, like they knew it, it was just like, they gave me, their cocoa butter it was amazing i blended it with my cocoa butter and i've been having these like super compressed jars for like a couple years and i was like I finally i need to do something with this i'm gonna make deodorant it's super easy i'll let you know so i got this pot and like a towel put the towel at the bottom put the cocoa butter in here like a double boiler method melted it down to where it was filled to the top the other one was filled with the liquid cocoa butter right then I transferred it into the 32 ounce mason jar. You can, you know, do whatever you want. The main point is that it's equal parts of your liquid, like your liquid solids and then your powders. So I poured out the cocoa butter in the other jar and I filled this up with three things. Arrowroot flour, tapioca flour, and baking soda. I did each of them in thirds because I wanted kind of equal parts and I did a little bit more baking soda because I wanted it. I wanted more baking soda. Boom, dumped it in the mason jar that was already halfway full of the liquid solid cocoa butters and like all that kind of stuff, all the good oils that I had. And then I added lemongrass and bergamot. And so like imagine I have like one of those little spatula things because I do, I just didn't bring it out, but I stir, 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 blend it up. I think you can probably also use an immersion blender and make it easier, but I just stirred it by hand for like five minutes straight. And I definitely had to make sure that everything was incorporated. And you want to do half and half equal parts, um, probably no more, no less, because this is really the perfect consistency that I really wanted and was looking for. Because if you do too much powder, you won't have enough oil and cocoa butter, like the liquid solids, in order to absorb the powders. And then you'll be left over with these chunky powder like chunks or whatever in your deodorant. And you don't want that. So now I have deodorant all summer, all summer long. Yay!